Good evening, good evening, my brothers and my sisters. What I have for you today is a tarot card reading for the collective. Okay. So, I have a um, download. And the download is angel number 11. 22 11 22 so it, that can have some resonance to you or i can have some resonance to this read you can look that up and see like what it means so before we get started let's give thanks to the most high most high i give you thanks all right so that being said let's see what spirit have to say the energy spirit what is the energy of this read for today the energy of this read for today is dealing with the ten of cups the ten of cups talks about family so that's the energy of this read for today. So we're going to take this card. We're going to make this as a face front card. Okay, you can see it. So the next card talks about the moon. The moon talks about eliminating lies, secrets, that the family your family this energy it talks about the family somebody in your family is telling lies or have some secrets that needs to be illuminated so let's jump right into it okay let's see we're gonna give it a shake Holy Spirit, into the read. What do you want to eliminate about this family members? And it talk and then on the split of the deck, it say it talks about the moon and the three of pentacles. The moon talks about eliminate illuminating lies and secrets. The three of pentacles talks about collaboration. There's people in the background collaborating together as so with the Ten of Cups. Let's talk about family members. It's collaborating against you about something. And they tell a lie. Let's see. Let's see. By the split of the deck, three of pentacles. Wow, just pay attention. By the split of the deck, three of pentacles, judgment. The card fell on the floor. Is ending cycles. Okay, judgment was called for this situation to end. The collaboration behind the scenes. Yo, Seven of Wands talks about competition, haters, collaborating behind the scenes. Yeah. With the Eight of Swords, they try to keep you stuck. They sabotage something. Yeah, they did. With the two of wands, you turn your back on the situation. You realize your goals. You weren't trying to get caught up in that shit. I mean, that stuff. <laughs> Let's keep it gangster. With the, with the ten of swords, they try to end your life. They try to destroy you. They try to take you down. 
All right. Come on now. Let's, let's preach this thing. The queen of swords. Standing. This is the this is the emperor standing in her queen of swords energy. Like, y'all motherfuckers ain't finna get away with it. I'm just saying. That's authority. That's power. That is the hermit mode. That is a light worker, star seed, un- re- uncovering secrets. All right? Come on now. Spirit said with the six of wands, you got victory. You got victory. You got success. Empress, you got success with the Empress card. Everything is balanced. There's no more juggling. With the star card, guess what, Empress? See that yellow star right there? That's you. You the big star. You the head honcho. You are the phoenix rising. And see them other stars? That's your family. That's your members. That don't want you to reach success. But you destined for greatness. There's no weapon formed against you shall prosper. You are the high priestess. You already knew this was coming in the first place. Uh huh, uh huh. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Your shits. With the three of wands, what you was waiting on, your shits has come in. Uh huh. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. With the page of swords, alert, alert. With the four cups, you dissatisfied about something. You in hangman mode. You withdraw from all this shit. You decided to move forward with your four of wands. To your destiny. You want to remain on your path. Because you know. There's marriage ahead of you. The happy life. Your harvest. Your ships. Oh yeah. Yeah 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 yeah. All because of your. Eight of pentacles. All your work ethic. That you put in. You understand what I'm saying to you? With an eight of cups. You walked away from a situation. Because you knew. In your queen of pentacles energy. You knew. They was messing with your finances. Your spiritual wealth. So the king of swords represent official power, authority. Had to step in. Because the page of cups. Comes in with emotions. Not mature. About your. Ten of pentacles. About your success. About your finances. About your happiness. Because they refuse to do the work. 
So they want to remain in a nine of swords energy. Worried. Don't know what to do. Busted. Broke. Disgusted. Yeah, I'm talking to you, Emperor. It's the Emperor. It's that energy. He brought it on himself. He knew he had the finances with his king of pentacles energy. That's that's called spiritual that no, no, that's called material wealth. He knew he had the finances to make happen what he needed to happen. So he dug into the magic, manifesting shit. On the dark side and shit. Uh huh. Yeah he did. For this new beginning. Ace of Pentacles. Yeah he did. At all costs. He wanted to one up the Empress. But. He had to cloak himself. With the five of cups. Things did not turn out. The way he expected. I thought it would. <laughs> With the three of swords, he tried to break her heart. Temperance. That's all she ever wanted. It's the earth anger. That's all that's all the Empress ever wanted was peace. The death card. Spirit said it better end. With the Nine of Pentacles, the Empress is independent. She holding her own. She don't need no another Pentacle to survive and be comfortable and be a like a privileged lady. Nine of Pentacles? Oh, really? You got it. You celebrating? Be happy. Three of Cups? You celebrating that shit? With the chariot, you overcome conflict. And Spirit said that is the truth with the Ace of Souls. He said that is the truth. With the Six of Swords, Spirit said it's time to move away from all them dumbass haters. Competitors. Yeah, it is. With the king of wands. Yeah. You know. That boss energy. Past life. Counterpart. King of wands. Yeah I'm talking. Let's get it in. Yeah. Be coming in with an offer. Some news. With the Ten of Wands. He said, I come in to help you with these burdens. With the two of swords, you at crossroads, you indecisive, you don't know what, what the choice is you gonna make. The lover's card come behind it, that's two lovers coming together. Huh, you like, fuck. But with the seven, with the seven of pentacles, you already invested. What you invested in? Your past or your future? Yeah, decide. 
Spirit said, I'm giving you the full card. You either going to take a new beginning, taking a leap of faith. Mm. By letting go with the four pinnacle. Letting go. You got to let go. Uh, the king of mother what fucking cups. This is your past. You hear me? You got to let go your past. To reach. In the reverse. Become your wish fulfillment. Because if it was in the upright. It will be. Confusion. Illusions. But it's wish fulfillment. But you got to let it go. And with the Hierophant come behind it, that is a card that said, God card that said yes or no, and Spirit said yes. It's a yes, motherfucker. It's a yes. It's a yes. It's a yes. With the Queen of Wands. You are boss. You and your boss energy. You and your boss energy. Wow. You came a long way. But you got you 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 in a disagreement? You having a disagreement? But you with the eight of with the eight of wands, you moving forward. She you like, you know what? With the four of wands, you been in seclusion. Now you out. You like, I made my decision. I made my decision. I made my decision with the knight of swords it talks about confidence that means you was confident in making this decision and by being confident that gets you the nine of cups that's wish fulfillment understand what I'm saying because you stay true to yourself and the queen of cups nurturing caring Helping people. So now. You get happy memories. With the six of cups. You get happy memories. Wow. You get all them happy memories. Okay, like, damn. Everything you worked for, hoped for, dream. It's coming. Your shits. It's come in. Because with the page of wands, that's good news. That's good news, bro. You just got to stand strong. Because through all this. It's going to be a tower moment. They're going to have financial loss. Despair. It can even be death. With the five of pentacles. You understand what I'm saying to you? Be ambitious. With the Page of Pentacles, just be ambitious about it. Be ambitious. You know what I mean? Be ambitious. 
Cause it's an offer, it's another offer coming in. It's another offer coming in, Spirit said. It's a Knight of Cups, it's moving slow. But no, it's an offer coming in. All right. So let's see. It's another offer coming in, though. Yeah, it is. But the will is turned in your favor. The wheel has turned in your favor. Okay? You ain't got to worry about nothing. I'm serious. I'm trying to tell you the truth. The wheel has turned in your favor. You work, you went in and did the work. Your inner work. With the Knight of Pentacles, you did your work. Despite of all this conflict with the five of ones, these competitors, you got it done. With the strength card, you were strong as fuck. I mean, you were strong. The moon card, spirit illuminated the truth with their lies, and you had success with the ace of swans. You know what I'm saying? With the sun card, you got your fortune coming. It was just as called on this situation. The high priestess already knew what y'all was doing. When this y'all that the high priestess already knew that y'all was playing in y'all shadow side. The devil card. Stop playing. With the seven of swords. Hmm. Seven of Swords, right? Hold on. Y'all y'all think y'all y'all think y'all slick. Deception. Y'all bring upon deception about this relationship. Y'all was breadcrumbing. This two of cups, y'all was breadcrumbing this divine connection. Yeah, y'all did. Y'all ain't want that damn thing to come together. This family members right here, the energy of the of the reed. They did not want this divine connection to come together. They did everything they could to keep their union not to happen. It was family members. Yeah, they did that. It was justice called on it. They getting karma for it. They getting tower moments. You know what I'm saying? And the divine masculine and the divine feminine is still getting a, you know, beginning, new beginning. And everything they deserve. They getting victory. They getting success. They getting promotions. Despite of all the struggles and, and and everything they had to go through, they're getting redemption. This is a redemption card. They get to go to their new beginning and they and they um divine counterpart and have happy ever after and harvest land. Milk and honey. A mule. Acre, 30 mule, whatever the hell it is in the land. Acres and a mule or some shit type energy. Yeah, they is. This cycle is ended. Judgment was called. Justice was called. The will is turned in their favor. You know what I'm saying? What the fuck you want? I mean, excuse me. What you, what you want? What you want, dog? This is the tea. This is the juice. You know what to do. You can't count me out. This is Phoenix rising. Phoenix rising from the ashes. Resurrection. Y'all trying to 
bury her. Y'all trying to destroy her. But she risen. She bared her cross. And she coming to tell the truth. Whether you want it, you like it, it doesn't matter. This is the read. I'm here to slay. Family. Overall energy. This read is for you. All your manipulations. All your tricks. All your trickeries. Guess what? It has been returned to you. How dare you? How dare you? Whoever energy this is, how dare you? As above, so below. Just remember. This card right here ends the show. Ends the show. So, with that being said. With that being said. Let's pull some of these cards right here so we can get some energy, different energy, or maybe it'll match. Who knows, right? Who knows? It may match. Let's see what's going on. Spirit. Let's give it a shake. On the split of the deck, we got karmic is jealous. And we got ending relationships. So let's see. Let's dig deep, guys. Hope you guys stand prayed up. No matter what you have to go through in life. Just remember, God is only using you. No matter what, you gotta go through. Alright? No matter what it seems like. Let's see. Just do the inner work. Just do your inner work. Be compassionate. Be loving. Be kind. Be motivational. Inspire your, your, your brother and sister. You know what I'm saying? Uplift one another. Meditate. Worship. Pray. Believe. Okay. Let's see. What else, Spirit? What else do this energy need to tell the family that they not seeing? They had they hidden agenda. That part. Hidden agenda. What else, spirit? They are in despair. Learn to know what the hell you messing with. All that stuff. It don't work. Deceit and de betrayal. Yeah, they is. Yeah, they is. What else, spirit? What else does family need to know? That they, you know what I'm saying? That they not seeing. That they, it's about to happen to their ass, probably. Justice, karma justice. I can't make this up. Karma justice. Hmm. What else, man? Time to ground yourself. That could be talking about me, my energy and shit. What else, man? Yeah, they did. 
Don't worry, you got success in every aspect of your life. You ain't gotta worry about these dumbass people. What else, spirit? Here it is. You gonna get prosperity. That's why they mad. Shit. What else? You gonna get happiness and bliss and shit. Wow, they big, big mad shit. What else? Here it is. Here it is. Cause all because they jacking up. And racking up with an earth angel. Here it is. Abundance is your birthright. Here it is. You refuse to be gaslighted with these dumbass people. Comments and shit. You don't want to hear that shit. Anything else there? Yeah. They try to push you in third party situations, you know what I'm saying? Trying to act like your husband, man, relationship is doing something they ain't doing. But at the bottom of the deck, that's that karmic shit, you know what I'm saying? Let's go. Let's break their ass out. Let's get them, let's get them in. That's what we here for. They didn't know that, that it is what it is. Now you know. I told you to stand down. What else, dude? What else they need to see? Yeah! What else they need to see? Yeah, they need to see all this shit. I'm giving it to them. You better be... Good. Retreat and get away. The karmic. The player energy. Let's go. Yeah, it is. They try to break your heart. Yeah, they did. By doing magic. You can't make this up. What else, dude? Let's bust their ass off. Let's give them something to think about that they never gonna ever, 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 ever forget in life. They gonna always remember what I'm giving to their ass today. Let's go. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. It's the King of Wands. Past divine counterpart. High level soulmate. Kingdom spouse. That's connected to this bullshit. The spirit said you better think before you act. Hmm. Yeah, I can't make this up. Yeah. Spirit said they gang stalking you. Yeah, they did. At the same time, they want to act like they miss you. Yeah, they did. Let's see. Hmm. Yeah, they did. Let's give it a shuffle. Hmm. What up, Spirit? What up? Spirit said you chosen. Spirit says you've been sacrificed. Spirit said you in the twin flame connection. Spirit says you're going to have a new business opportunity coming. 
pay attention. Spirit said, I love you. Spirit said, you're going to get wish fulfillment, confirmation. Spirit said, there's a hidden pregnancy somewhere. Wow. Hidden pregnancy. Spirit clarified the hidden pregnancy. Jesus. All the cars went and fell, and fell down. Oh, that's deep. But they forgot. They forgot this card. Spirit said, Karma Dad, Karma Dad. Yeah, you want to hide shit? You can get some Karma Dad. Yeah, you is. Whoever the fuck this is, I'm gonna get it. Let's get it in. Okay, what else, spirit? Anything else before we end this read? I hope y'all keeping up. It talks about ending cycles. Because you made the decision from your heart and not with your head. Somebody want to communicate the truth with you. The Spirit said that is the truth. They had you in a third party. They threw shade on your name. All because of your glow up. Your investments. Judgment was called. You're going to have a breakthrough. Trust your intuition. There's a hidden camera. You walked away. You're getting a proposal. You're getting your inheritance. You're ending relationships, whether that be family, whatever. There's spiritual drill for their karma. You surrender to the connection. Your counterpart said he needs you forever. You get an unexpected money. Spirit saying keep going. Even though they ghosted you. You go into the promised land of milk and honey. They've been doing mac black magic. You purchasing a new home and land. Spirit said, I'll forgive you. Your, your counterpart said, I'm sorry for making you an option. Y'all purchasing a new car. Spirit said, drop your damn ego. You getting the blonde, you getting divine blessings with the star card. You getting divine masculine. No more jealousy in your energy. Divine, divine, your counterpart said they sorry for hurting you. The karmic is jealous. Your counterpart abandoned you, that's past energy. Now it's time for a new beginning. Gain your strength. Forgive them and move on. Divine feminine, they talk about you. Forgive and move on. Think before you act. Somebody asking you to unblock their ass because they got your phone tapped. Trying to make you stuck. As above, so below. You open up your heart for these clowns. All because you destined. Spirit said that's the truth. Your counterpart said I choose you. They said they lonely without you. Mm. Spirit said get away in trouble. Your counterpart said my happy is with you. Spirit said I'm giving you a promotion. 
Spirit said, be patient. Your counterpart wants communication. Your counterpart want to build together with you. They made you an option. Spirit said it's a spiritual warfare. Stay hydrated. It's time to drink some water. Ha ha ha. I'm about to drink some water. Spirit said drink some water. Ha ha ha. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Spirit says somebody's shape shifting around you. Divine intervention. No, divine intervention stepping in to take charge of that situation. The will of fortune is turned in your favor. No matter what's going on in your life, the will is turned in your favor. No more bread crumbing. It's all fairness. That's what we talked about in this tarot card deck. It talks about your work, fairness, all that. What's going on? But in this read, we talks about we talks about your divine connection coming together no more. Bread coming is is give and take. You in a new relationship? Somebody been transformed, rebirth. You know what I'm saying? It was a disagreement, and and and, and spirit came in, illuminated the situation about these lies and, and and secrets. You gained your strength. You overcome conflict and competition. No matter if they still going on with they dumb stuff. You know what I'm saying? You got, you got, over, over your work, it's about your work, but the will of fortune turned in your favor, you know what I'm saying? And you disagree about the, um, the four cups, you know what I'm saying? You went in hangman mode, thought about the situation, about your work with your eight of cups. I mean, with your eight of pentacles, you thought about your work performance and stuff. It's the, with the, um, with the eight of cups, you turned your back on the situation no longer serving you. You and your queen of pentacles energy. That talks about stability. King of swords talks about power, authority. Like it's a, like you had to be some authority figure had to come in and situate the situation. Because the mature, immature... Page of Cups come in and it's dealing with your Ten of Pentacles, all your success, finances, and stuff like that. With the Nine of Swords, they try to keep you woke in this energy. Wow. They try to keep you woke in this energy. And your Nine of Swords are worried about this situation. But with the Temperance card, that talks about peace. You know what I'm saying? You need peace. Spirit said, but the. Death card, it has to end because they try to break your heart because you're very independent. You know what I'm saying? Even though things didn't turn out the way it's supposed to with the Five of Cups, but you're still getting a new beginning with the Ace, the Pentacle, you're getting a new beginning. You're manifesting it with the um, Magician card, and it talks about motherfuckers. I mean, excuse me. It talks about people doing ma magic in the background on you. It, this talks about the king of pinnacles. That's your finances. That talk about your, um, like, um, overall finances. Like, stability. You want for nothing in life. You already grounded. Everything. You got everything. And then the empress card talks about your counterpart. All right. And it talks about things as balance. It talks about you got success and victory. It talks about you waiting on your ships. And it came in already. It talks about you turned your back on conflict and disagreement. You have good news. You know what I'm saying? It talks about it was justice. It talks about the high priestess already knew this was going on. It was just waiting for a matter of time for the judgment and justice to be called on it. The sun card. You getting fortune. The four wands, you get, you get married, you get a happy life, bliss type situation. You get new relationships, you got a new relationship with peace, strong. The wheels turned in your favor. It's all good. That's all I gotta say.
And then the cards I made, it speaks about everything that's happened, about the bread coming and making you an option. And it talks about the, the divine counterpart, talks about his truths, what he did. And it talks about um, what the divine is doing for you. Like the divine is coming through with divine intervention. When divine step in, everything go according to plan. To plan. Divine can also be a reminder. Like when I read my cards, it talks about stay hydrated. As, as I always have a bottle of water on my altar. That's a reminder for me to drink some dang water. Understand what I'm saying to you? So, with that being said, the Wheel of Fortune, once again, confirmation as above, so below. Where's the Wheel of Fortune? It's down here somewhere. I was going to try to show you where I was going to put it together where this is Wheel of Fortune. That's the Wheel of Fortune. That's confirmation that that is what's happening the, the wheel is turning in your favor there's people around you doing spell work whatever in this spiritual warfare they send us they send in spells your way they shape shift and turn it from humans into animals they 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 can shape shift like if you have neighbors they can shape shift from they unit into your unit and they try to do that shit while you sleep you understand what i'm saying and cast all kind of spells on your butt Y'all better wake up. Alright. You need to have communication. Maybe it's talking about open communication. With your counterpart. Or with your family. Whatever resonate. Take it. And leave the rest. But you gotta be patient for this process. You got a promotion. Either you know about it. Or it's, or it's about to enter your life. Your counterparts say they happy is with you. If you made that option to stick around. And Spirit said that is true. Like I just said as above so below. You're no longer stuck. You just need to get away and travel. And, and get your thoughts together. Because at the end of the day. All that you work for. This new beginning. Let's get it in. Let's get it cracking. That's what you're going for. Okay. So with that being said. That is the overall energy. It talks about family, how they're trying to sabotage, come in between your happiness and your and your um, divine counterpart. The family has interfered with the nine, with the ten of cups. That talks about. Look at this. In this read, it talks about. So this could be wish fulfillment, but at the end of the day, in this read, it come off as an energy of your family is interfering in your life. Whether it be in your work, whether it be in your love life, all right? And the energy speaks for itself. This family is interfering and doing all kind of stuff behind the scenes. Uh, in your love life, trying to keep you from coming together with your counterpart as you are destined to be together, all right? They don't want to see that shine. They hate ass. They don't want to see that shine. So that's what I have for you today. That's what I have for you today in this general read. It was awesome. Once again, it's, it's still jealousy out here in this energy. It's still jealousy out here in this energy about your connection with your counterpart. But it revealed and busted out your family members in this read. That they are behind the scenes doing some low down, dirty, dumb ass shit to you. Pay attention. Pay attention. Yeah, it is. That's the overall energy of this read. Family is doing the most behind the scenes to keep you stuck. To keep you from not reaching your destiny. Whatever it is, they got justice. Whatever it is, you got justice for it. Whoever this energy is, you got justice. So... Your ancestors is going to kick they raggedy ass in they ass. Kick they ass 10 yards around the world. With that karma. Just know that. This is your family today. Your family being busted out today. How many times y'all going to learn to stop? Messing with the high priestess. She know you're doing it before you're doing it. 
She know you doing it before she get the download. She just need proof. Now the proof is here. It's your family. Whoever this energy is, if it resonates, yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Yeah, they doing it. So all y'all who trust in your family, they would never do nothing wrong to you. They would never hurt you. Them the same effer loving mother uckles that's destroying you. That's putting curses on you. That's getting insur insurance policies out on you. That's causing havoc in your life. And you sitting there saying this is my loved one. I love them. And I trust them. They will never leave me. Forsake me. But at the same time. They are stabbing you. They are breaking your heart. Yeah, they is. They are causing conflict in your life. Yeah, they is. Your family, your bloodline. They're keeping you up at night in your nine of swords. Like, what the heck? This is what they're doing. They're manifesting on you. They're manifesting on your past. They're manifesting on your presence. They're manifesting on your future. Right here, look, look. These ever-loving, ever-mother... Right. Is doing this to you. They think because... You trust them and love them so much, like... They wouldn't be doing that. Well, I'm here to encourage you. They is doing that. Yeah, they is. Sorry, yeah. Okay. Okay. Hmm. So, that being said, that's the energy. It is what it is. I'm going to say what it is. Family ain't shit. Ha, ha, ha. Take it as it is. You keep trusting them motherfuckers, they're going to keep fucking you up. Alright? It is what it is. At the end of the day, this energy do have victory. So, trust your intuition. Stand by it. Believe in it. You got victory, you got success, no matter what. No matter what these dumb haters ass do. You got it. You bagged it. Let's keep it moving. Next. Chosen one has spoken. That is the energy. Family ain't shit. Take it or leave it. I'm out. Signing out. So with that said, my brothers and sisters, I thank you all for stopping by to see what sales lady boss so got pop like on her channel. So with that being said, I'll see you guys in my next video. Wait for it. Peace, peace. My brothers and sisters, I'll see you guys in the next one. If you feel led to donate to my channel, feel free. To hit me up in my PayPal and my Cash App. Because what I have given you today has been nothing but six of one success. Stop trusting. They're the same ones that's destroying you. Think for yourself. So, with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next one. Glad to be back. With that being said, peace, peace. I'm out. See you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.